back with another video. Krishan exposes Blueface for calling her right after he proposed to Jaden. And Jaden says Blueface still wants Krishan. Let's get into it. Before we get into it, like the video, subscribe to the channel, and hit the notification bell so you'll be notified of my videos. And go ahead and share it if you like. So this whole thing has gotten messy. So Kashawn is going live talking about it. She posting stuff. She posts a video of Blueface, him calling her, trying to talk to her, her talking about how she dealt with him right after he got proposed. She dealt with him right after he left the Jason Lee show, all of that stuff. Like they had been dealing the whole time. And then his baby mom, well, his fiance, should I say, he say his, his wife, but anyway, his wife, fiance, whatever you want to call her, Jaden talks to her friend and says that she knows that Blueface still wants Krishan. And she's feeling some type of way like she shouldn't even took the ring. Like I'm saying, you took the ring, I'll take it, I'll keep it, but you don't have to marry that man. Just realize that. But let's go ahead and get started. So this is a conversation between Jaden and her friend. They're talking and this is what she talking about everything. So if you look right here and say, what you doing? Here at the house, just finished the interview. How did it go, Jaden? So why is she saying, how did it go, Jaden? I don't say that too many times to my friends. We already talking, I'm talking to you directly, or we DMing, or we, we talking, or whatever in a text. Mm, I don't usually say the person's name unless we're in a group. It went well. So it's almost like she's setting her up to post this or they're setting it up together I don't know blue face get on my nerves why you say that he always recorded me I shouldn't have accept the ring why so at that point she said she shouldn't have accepted the ring she feel like you know he's always recording her and you know all that type of stuff she feel like it's about the money at this point I feel that it's all for the camera. I love him, but deep down, I know he really need the money, girl. Cause you know he got that little little situation with all that money, thirteen million dollars, and that's why he doing it. Cause I'm gonna tell y'all something. Certain states, if you're married, they can't take but so much of your money. They can't come for but so much of your money. They have to give you time and all that stuff like that when you're married. Some states, and in some states, they can take your spouse's money too. But in some states they can't. So it might be a situation to where I'm married and, you know, I got to provide for my family. Don't take my money. And then the fact he wants to marry her to make sure and get that money, or at least put that ring on her finger to make her think, you know, we're going to be together forever so she can get them checks and pass it over to him. I never knew you felt this way, but you guys look so happy. Look so very deceiving. I'm happy with him. The world knows that. But all he talks about is money. I'm starting to feel he loves the money more than me, best friend. So why she had to say best friend like that? That might be just how they talk, but it just seemed like a whole setup. But anyway, he thinks I don't know he still goes see Krishan. So she knew it. She knew it the whole time. And Krishan is saying it and he's trying to act like, no, I'm not. I'm not going over there. She know it. She know it. But he's just trying to play face and save face and oh, this is my wife, I love her, and all of this kind of stuff, and it's only her, and I, we all know. She done been through this. She marry you, that's that's on her. She playing herself, or she know and just don't care. You know, it'd be like this sometimes. Hey, you can't judge everybody. People be out here with people, husbands and, and, and boyfriends, or the, the wife know that the husband is out there doing something, or the husband know the wife is out there doing something, and they just go on with life, so... If I do that stuff, they're just in the spotlight because they famous. So, you know, we can't judge. So, Blueface posts this. This ish cap. Come on, cuz. That's my boo girl. I'm married. Get your girl, bro. He know that it's not my boo's girl. He know they ain't even dealing like that. He just trying to use that to make everybody think he ain't dealing with her. And he with his say his, he's married. But you know how people say that ahead of time. But yeah, he know they ain't my boo's girl. He know... She ain't with no my boo. Everybody know that. They good friends. I only follow my wife. I don't see half the stuff y'all see. I actually have a life for real. Yeah, you got a life. You be following her. You be talking to her. 
You be DMing her, texting her, calling her, all kinds of stuff. Stop trying to play like you don't see what she's talking about because you know exactly what she be talking about. Stop playing. That's why you're saying what you're saying. So you know Krishana seen what he said and stuff. She, you know, she gonna know. I got receipts. You just called me crying about me being out with my boo. Which I know he has. He's been out, like, doing her like that. So I'm gonna let you see this video of her she's calling him she's on the phone with him you know he's saying some stuff it seemed a little crazy because like he's still being very disrespectful but the way he's talking you could tell he's being back with her but at the same time he's still trying to talk and you hear somebody talking in the background which i think is Jaden. krishan says she don't think it's Jaden, but I, she thinks it's another girl but i think it's Jaden in the background he's trying to talk a little different because he know she's there like she's right there so he don't want to do too much, even though he knows that Jaden knows he's been coming to see Krishan. So I'm going to let you go ahead and see that. And I'm going to come back with the rest of her, you know, tweets and all the other stuff and some more videos. Hello? Hello? Yeah. What do you mean? Did you mean to call me? <laughs> you call me what? Yeah, you call me, didn't you? Yeah, cause you keep hanging up and blocking me and uncalling me. Why are you mad at me? I'm not playing around. That's crazy. I fuck with you. What you mean? I'm at I'm at Waffle House. Kicking it with who? <laughs> Babe, that's the music shit. I don't. What? What's it open, Shorty? Yeah, I got you. Yeah, I got you. Yeah, I got you. I'm not doing with that shit. Babe, we just dropped the song. I'm. Alright. Huh? You're not in the mix or nothing. Huh? What you mean, what's the point? Why is it we for life first early in the morning and then late at night? Fuck. I pick one. Stop. Stop. Like. What are you? I just thought. Bro, stop acting slow. I'm not acting slow. That's the crazy thing. I'm not. Talking about me like we fuck with each other. We do fuck with each other. No, we don't. Then why we be fucking with each other then? We don't fuck with each other. Oh, so it's fuck us. Why you're feeling so deep involved is like about Because if you're finna be on stage saying fuck blue face with the nigga, what are you what, why are you making my life harder on Instagram? Oh, it's making it harder. We, we good. We Cause good you capping. You know damn well you doing that dumb shit. It's not even for real, for real. Bro, who the fuck are you to, to give a fuck or to say anything, man? Because I love you. Me? What do you mean? How you love me if you say Alright, so me? I gotta tell you something. I got good news. But I wanna, uh. Well, I don't give a fuck about Yeah, you do. Me. Yeah, you do. Because the fuck. Yeah, I got a surprise for you, bro. Hi. Yeah, you, you. Yeah, you do. Alright. What do you mean, alright? Huh? You're like a weirdo. What? <laughs> You heard what I said, right? I don't care what you just said, bro. Okay. Cause, what, what? Hello? I'm not a weirdo. There's no winning with you. I try to fuck with you on the... Yeah. Why the fuck are you still sitting outside the car? Because, bro. Alright. Hello? Yeah. If you can listen to me arguing with the bitch, shut the fuck up and sit down. Who are you talking to? Bro, stop Can you stop playing with me? I'm not playing with you. You yes, don't want, you are. You don't want to call on my stop. phone like I care about who stop. in the back row. Stop. It, my pussy get wet listening to your dumb ass on my phone. Stop. What? What's up? Stop what? Fucking you? Stop, stop letting you nut at me? Yeah, all of it. <laughs> you know, I can't let that slide, baby. Uh, 
<laughs> so who did you with? Because it's obviously yeah. not your wife. Is that what's that? No, it's somebody else's. Who is that? You don't think it sounded like that? I don't know what's up with him. Why he be calling my phone just to, to me, argue to, to make me, me mad? Like Why he trying to make me mad though? Trying to make her mad. Who is? You trying to make Jaden mad? No, he trying to make me mad oh, for nothing. Man. I, I said you okay? No, he just weird as shit. I'm about to call one more time because this nigga, I'm just bondoozled. Why are you playing like that? You know damn well that pussy ain't wet. That's, That's why he calling my phone mad as shit. How he calling my phone? He telling the bitch put his dick in my bitch. She must not doing it right. Let me let me ask him if she doing it right. Right, Is 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 that shit wet or what? Let me let me eat out. Of. Then he been mean to the bitch. Don't even know she make a TikTok about him. <laughs> Bro, shit. You don't even. She, she like. She be like. She he, the whole time. She's on the phone. <laughs> she might have put it. He kept calling done. back. He called back, and then now he trying to not answer. But why you call? Hello. Please leave your message. Why you call me in first? So she said, "I really been chilling." Cause she said she been chilling out. She ain't been like going after him. He been coming to see her. Right after they got off of uh, Jason Lee's show, he was over there with her too. So he's been going back and forth. And Jay didn't know that. If those are real, somebody sent me those. If those are real messages between Jaden and her friend, she know that. But even if it's not, Jay didn't know that still. You know. So I'm just going to tell y'all them, them messages is something somebody sent me saying it was between um, Jaden and her friend. But even if it's not real, Jay didn't definitely know. She know he's still going over there. And she know he still loves Krishan. And she feeling some type of way about that ring. Like, I shouldn't have took that ring because he's still over there. He's still doing what he's doing. You know, hey, you took the ring, but you ain't married to him. Boo-boo, you can take that right on off and keep it moving. If that's what you feel like you need to do, but we can't judge. It's your situation. She like, y'all, I'm out traveling, getting money for Krishan Jr., this ninja blue. It's just somewhere lost, keep getting at me, like I'm forcing him to pretend to the world he's happy. This ninja, just one of my ninjas. I'm not the old Krishan. We used to ask those type of questions when I live with you. Boy, you got your life, I got mine. I'm not ever here calling you asking about your mess. I just vibe out with you because we got something here. But we're just friends. Carry on, baby daddy. I love you, weirdo. Stop calling. I've been falling back. The more you want fake love me, it's just going to hurt you because I'm going to still do me. So, anyway, she's on live. She's talking about it. And she's talking about how she's been with him. He was just there and all this kind of stuff and how she's feeling. And she's, she's locked, they locked in for life. Like, she's there forever. She ain't going nowhere. And I guess at this point, Jay didn't know that. Jay didn't know Krishan ain't going away. Everybody know Krishan ain't going away. It's just to play the height, the up, down, back, forth, whatever. You know, it is what it is. If that's what she decided to do, she still want to be with her baby daddy or she want to kick it with him on the side here and there. Like she said, he's not the only one. That's that's her prerogative. That's what she want to do. But I just hate it when the kids come in the middle of this, all this back and forth playing and stuff. And for Jaden, I feel bad for her. I really do. Because like she said, He's the only one she's been with. And she's still being faithful to him as far as that. She's been with females and stuff. But, like, as far as that, like, he's a, he allowed her to do that. So, at this point, she not cheating. She not doing nothing crazy. And she be there for him. She's always there for him and stuff. I feel bad for her. I feel bad for... I feel bad for Kashawn too. Even though y'all don't feel bad for I feel bad for Kashawn because he got her mind. He got her mind bad. Like, she's steady going back, steady going back. But she said she's dealing with other people at the same time. It's getting crazy at this point. But this is what they want. They want the drama. They making money off this drama. Hey, if that's what they decide they want to do, I'm not mad. Who am I to judge? We got people out here that's married. And then these other women out here messing with their husband and stuff. And think that's okay. And, you know, and they dealing with that. And they like, I just want my family to be okay. You know, it's, it's a lot of stuff. So, it is what it is. But anyway, I'm going to let y'all go ahead and see this live with her talking about all that stuff. And then she talks a little bit to um stunner girl you seen the other live with stunner girl but she's talking about some other stuff on here talking about her music and all that stuff like that 
But anyway, let's go ahead and get to that part. No better. Water. <laughs> Water. Stunna. Where my baby stun at? She been on her um unbothered shit lately. When they get unbothered, they get pregnant. And Stunna looks so cute. She be with her little uh, nephew. I'm waiting for Stun to be a mom already. So we can have kid dates because so cute. Hey y'all, look at my two. So, um, look, y'all. I decided to get a Bentley. I actually get in two cars. One for Junior, one for me. I missed my flight. I got a show today, but I'm catching a later one. It's fine, because I left my tooth. I left my tooth, I had to turn them down. And then, um, <coughs> I saw this video and then, uh, shut that door so the smoke don't go out there. So look, I'm getting this Bentley. It's baby blue, cream seated. <coughs> it's a four hundred dollar car, four hundred thousand dollar car. Big rock, not the little one, but the owner is in Germany. So when I was trying to buy it yesterday, I couldn't get it because it was two a.m. in Germany. So. This morning, I get it this morning. That shit finna be in my driveway. Oh, yeah, in Birmingham, Alabama. I'm gonna be there. So, pop out with your girl. Pull up on me. $400,000 car? $400,000, yes. A house. <laughs> yeah, just no, that's just a car. <laughs> that's not a house. The house I want is eighty million. I know, but I'm talking about a regular house. That shit is way over the price. <laughs> not the house we got regularly. No, I'm talking it's about just in LA. That's no, why is that my house oh. somewhere else is a whole big house. Like if a Texas. house in Georgia. A house Where in my Texas. upper chain at? It's in, where the Gucci bag? It's in the Gucci bag, Marsh. I don't know. Is it a black truck? Do you want it? Huh? Low key, yeah. I want to put that bitch on. Right now? Where the fuck is it? Y'all keep saying why I wear this. Oh, God, it's because, like, I ain't gonna hold you. This month for life, for real. As much as we don't get, get, like, get each other right now. He's still gonna pull up like he did yesterday. Like, <laughs> like you feel me? We're really like just locked in forever. And then I can't take away from who he is and what he did in my life. Like, I'm Big Rock because of this goofy ass nigga y'all hate. But anyway, cheese. No, I'm being dead ass. Like, I'm tired of everybody keep on trying to. Like, he's doing what he's doing right now because <coughs> out of pain. That's Let me tell you. He did that out of pain because if he was doing that before this, all this shit, all this breakup shit, then we would have been like, all right, cool. But we got over the, our differences for real. He's still nothing in me. So I'm kind of like. 
I don't know what he's doing. Like, you know, he's just all over the place. But anyway. I'm just being a honey. Like, I'm not doing nothing for no clout. Like, okay, those link ups. Me and Cinco, we are friends. We're not fucking none of that. Like, what? We're cool. I, I, I stopped having male friends because I wasn't like that. That ghetto ass relationship. Hey, Stunner, baby. I was just talking about your ugly ass. Hey. I was talking about you need to become a mommy because, bitch, I'm looking at your stories and you look like a whole mother. And I'm like, is she pregnant yet? But yeah, I'm just living my life, my nigga. I make my own money. I make my own. I do my own. But I don't know. We could pretend, but I ain't finna pretend. I'm finna just give it to you straight. You hear me? I think me and Blue, want to, we want to leave each other alone. We really do. It just never will happen. I can't give him what he want. He can't give me what we want. So we just have that, that toxic ass sex. That toxic ass... Nigga, I ain't never leaving. <laughs> I'm just like, all right, yo. Long as I got my own shit. Fuck that. <laughs> Real shit. But, um. <clears throat> my shit stuck because it was in the bag. I, I fucked up my whole chain. And this bitch heavy. <laughs> I'm outside. I'm about to go live with you, Stunner. So long. I miss you. Stunner, you trying to do a song? Oh, look at you. You look like a little Barbie doll with no makeup on. Uh, sis, you talking about my pregnant bitch? I'm outside. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's not that, yo. You such a mother, yo. Cause remember when I came over, you was all nurturing me and shit. And then I your know. nephew been around you, nigga. It looked like it looked like seven were kids on God. You got that mother effect. I know. I was. I just be watching. We outside. I just, Tell I just be you. watching Tell my nephew. Come on, do it in the motherfucking live. This bitch funny as fuck. Hold on, let me set my phone up. Tamar, can you request to be in live if you don't want to? It's okay. I said, I just be watching. I said, ooh. I said, I just be watching my nephew. I don't know, but you do a good job, yo. Come on. You need to get outside. Where you at, LA? Yeah, but I'm about to go, I'm about to, go to the show at uh, Alabama. And then I got... I do this shit with Kai, then I gotta do this shit with Cam Newton. <laughs> I know I heard you going to jail for a day. I'm like, what the fuck is she Tell doing? Chris to come on the show. Oh, oh yeah, funny marker. I'ma lock it with your dumb ass too. I can't wait. That nigga funny too. But all right, if I come on your show, don't play with me, yo. Cause you be playing with everybody that come on your show. He I'm gonna be nice to you. He messaged me to do an interview too. I seen that sweet ass interview. To do an interview too, and then I'm like, nigga, I'm finna pull up. And then, uh, funny Marco. Right, you need to get in the interview. Fuck, that I'm trying to see you, huh? Like, <laughs> <laughs> hey, yo, I use the huh in my song, yo. Huh? I use the huh in my song, yo. I thought of you. <laughs> Only thing that's broke is my motherfucking voice. What I say? Gave birth to my kid, but I hate his father. No, this that newborn pussy make my water break. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how to say it like you, but I say it how. Oh, hey, you know what the fuck going on. And hey, you was wilding. <laughs> had, had to, yo. It's too much going wilding. on. The video's cute, though. Oh, thank you. Yeah. You doing good, too. I like that little French Montana collab you did. I know. That's, that was a couple months ago. I just dropped this song today. Oh, you just dropped it today? Yeah. 
I don't know if you remember, I was playing you this song when you was at my house. Nigga, every song you played, I'm mad that they don't have. Like, what? <laughs> every, no, no, real shit. Stunner, you need to just drop. Why are you holding it? And then you was road running. I was like, damn, bitch, every time I look up, you so weird. Like, sit the fuck no, down. No, Stunner, hey, yo, I want to do a song with you, but you got to write my shit. I am. Real shit. Get you together. <laughs> I mean, I could try and try. And I'm, I'm gonna be a hundred. I just need help, huh? I'm gonna have you. I'm gonna have you yeah. on some fly trap shit. <laughs> not like, you, you, you know, sure a lot of motherfuckers not dragging with not, that nigga. You know why? Because they fuck up their algorithm, how they look, all type of shit. You dragging, and you dragging the hard way. <laughs> because you can't take your nigga everywhere. You can't. I'm gonna be a hundred. You can't do shit. I'm gonna be honest. If, if the nigga not in the industry, get nigga not in the industry like that, for real, for real. So it's like, nah, you can't take him anywhere. You can't really be posted up like how you posted up with your niggas because it's just not heard of. Where the fuck is the charger? My Girl, I, fuck, I, fuck with, uh, I fuck with an elite, an elite street nigga that already, that already knows everybody that didn't already, you know what I'm saying? So I no, don't even care what that was a real ass because bar because they're because not that's here. Facts. This industry not here they don't want you posting like, your nigga. They're not here to, you know, be in my relationship. They need to listen to no, my music not. and that's all <laughs> they Y'all see what I'm saying? This whole thing is messy, baby girl, Jaden. Even though you took that ring, don't mean you still got to be with him. They don't mean you got to marry him at this point. You're not married to him, so you don't feel obligated to do anything. I know you feel obligated because you got kids and you love this man. You've been with him forever. You've been there by his side. You ain't been with nobody else. You don't want to really be with nobody else because you just want that same image. Like, I've been with only one guy and that's all I've been with. So I get it. And then you want him to be around for your kids because you feel like if y'all not together no more, he's not going to be around for his kids like he would normally be. So I get that. And like I said, I can't judge anybody because I understand some people go through things, they feel certain ways. Certain people can't deal with certain things. Certain people can deal with certain things. You know he's still dealing with Kashawn because you said it. And even if those those texts or whatever is not real, she still knows that he's dealing with Kashawn. So, you know, it is what it is. She's still playing the happy role, showing her ring off and all of that stuff. But baby girl, go on, leave him. And Kashawn, stop dealing with that dude. But like I said, I can't, I can't say anything. You know, like, it's, it's not my situation. Is y'all situation that's what y'all want to deal with so you know it is what it is and y'all need to stop saying i'm delusional about kashan no i'm not delusional about kashan i like kashan y'all like some of these people out here that's doing some crazy stuff or whatever i still like her i'm still rooting for her she's young and yes she is young she's still young i'm rooting for her i want her to do good she got a baby now she could be a good mom and you know all that stuff like that Ain't nobody expect her to be a good role model. When she came into this, everybody knew how she was. She was off the chain and did whatever she wanted to do. That's what she liked to do. She'll pop off. That's how a lot of people know her, popping off and doing stuff. So don't get mad with her now. She came, she showed y'all who she was and showing y'all who she is. So don't feel no type of way about it. There's a lot of people that I like to do crazy stuff, but I can like who I want to like. And I can talk about who I want to talk about over here. If people get mad, why are you still talking about Kashawn? Because that's who I want to talk about. You don't like the conversation or you don't like me talking about her then hey you know you see the title you know what it's about so but y'all that's here to watch and support the channel i appreciate y'all keep watching keep supporting y'all check me out on social media check out my shop check out my igt page check out my uh shop shop with your girl y'all go over to banger plate gang subscribe subscribe to banger plate gang y'all Make sure you subscribed over here. Subscribe to Brown Sugar. Y'all still support. Like I said, it's down over there. But thank y'all for y'all support. I really do appreciate it. Thank you guys for watching. And as always, be blessed.